So we've been combining two things, the burst mode and the dynamic autofocus. So there is different things in the autofocus dynamic, the continuous autofocus. And this, you can use it with the 3D tracking setting. For example, if you want to capture someone running, do the focus like just one or two meters before the person arrive. So then when the person is running and reaching that point, then it's neat. The burst mode allows you to capture six frames per second. It gives you lots of options because you're catching lots of details. So then you have a range. You can choose your pictures in between others and it's not only one.